Oh gosh, Pluto, I sure love watching video games about Disney characters while listening to a guy talk about the game over the commentary. Wow! That's basically like the highest form of entertainment stimulus I can think of. That's what's playing in a nutshell, kids. Hey, Internet, I'm Color Florida, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. So that weird opening aside, today we're going to finish up our second visit to Traverse Town and then uh, soup up our gummy ship with our new parts that we've got and ride to the next world. It should be a hoot and a half. Alright, so the gizmo shop is this way, past the hotel. Now yeah, forget it, they're not worth it. If you didn't see the last episode, basically what happened is that we met Riku, but he ditched us because he thought we were being a jerk. So now we think Riku's being a jerk. It's the classic sitcom. Also, using the lightning in that one place in the third district might have powered the gizmo shop as well. Yay, we get more HP! Stupid fat guy. Take that, doofus. Man, there are tons of enemies in here. Oh yeah, air, air soldiers drop uh, spirit gems, apparently. Alright, so we, we want to get up in the rafters of this store, and what better way to do that than this platform there? I do not know what that button does, but I'm assuming it does something uh, cool. Kill the healers first. Thunder Shard, please and thank you. And I'm not sure if we can actually get up there. Didn't I already kill a fat guy? Forget this. We're leaving. There are two entrances to the gizmo shop. This one takes us to an interesting little alcove in the second district. And there's a ladder here. Also, I think I'm going to take this opportunity to show off the summons. Let's summon Simba! So as awesome as that opening is, Simba's not actually a terribly great summon. Let's charge up. So we can use charge up and he'll roar. But wow, that just ate up his summon gauge. And he's already gone, yeah. Although we did kill all the enemies, so... Let's use Trinity. Now I want to say there's a chest up here somewhere. Oh, that's right. Now we can go across the rooftops to get to new areas. Actually, no, we can't. We need some shared abilities before we can do that! That was close. Let's rain this bell. Suddenly, we're Quasimodo. And ooh, that's interesting. Found in the main plaza's changing. That's beautiful. Let's ring it one more time. Ooh, 
well, well. That's pretty uh, cool. And we found the keyhole for Traverse Town. Let's check it out. You remember this guy? We get a rematch with the guard armor. This time, however, it'll be a much more fair fight. Especially since we have Cure now. Of course, it's not going to be that easy. Ooh. Welcome to the true boss of Traverse Town, the mixed up armor. It's like the guard armor, but quite a bit harder. But actually, probably a quite a bit easier because we can cure now and we're stronger than we were when we fought the guard armor. Also, I think it's really cool how they took a, like an already complete heartless and then like just by changing the design slightly, make a totally different thing out of it. Yeah, cure. I did not want to heal myself there. Hey, you know what? Donald and Goofy don't really help you for this fight anyway, so... Let's just beat it up. So we're facing enemies with giant amounts of HP now, and because of our extra good Keyblade and the Cure ability, it's actually not too bad. You also want to make sure you heal yourself before you get to the danger rating, because, well, if you don't, you might just get one-shotted. Alright. Got just its regular body left. Boom! Boss fights are fun now! And much easier. Goodbye, mixed up armor. You were an amusing fight. Ugh, the Mad Hatter owns the shoe shop. Ooh! And now we get the power of wind. We learn the spell Arrow. That's another underrated spell in the game. I didn't really use it in my first playthrough. I should have. It makes most boss fights a lot easier. And we get this neato picture of Sora sealing the keyhole in Trevor's Town. And now the mural is beautiful again. And we get the Navi G piece. Let's talk to Sid about that one. Hi, can I get... No, I can't jump up there yet. Hey, Sid! We found something cool back there. Hey, got another navigation gummy there, eh? I'll bet you want it installed. Yeah, please. Hmm, looks like this is another one of those blocks that come in sets. You gotta find the mate to this one. Aw, lame. Alright, well, we've had enough of Traverse Town. Do I have money? Ooh, I do have money. I could buy... something from the item shop. Actually... First, let me check to see if Sid's got anything, like if I can upgrade the gummy ship.
Because, like, you can buy pieces from him, but you can also just buy upgrades. Com level 2, 500. Ah. Darn it. Why would I want to buy spray? Alright, well. I'll get that on my next visit to Traverse Town. We can visit Traverse Town very quickly now because of the warp block we have in our gummy ship. Alright, we'll buy the Smasher for Goofy. Stout Shield says Smasher! A small shield made for attack rather than defense. Yeah, so that'll boost his strength by two. Hang on. So with the stout shield, I want to check. So Goofy has got 16 defense right now. If we give him the smasher, he has 16 defense. Okay. Well, I don't know why I bought him the stout shield then. Goofy, you've got the smasher now. Smasher's better, apparently. I don't even know why I bought him the Stout Shield if it doesn't do anything. Wow. I feel like a moron. But anyways, we get to exit the world now. There's a tournament being held at the Coliseum! I hear there's a great reward for the winner! So if you want, you can go back to Olympus to do the journey. Or do the, uh... Cup. I recommend beating a world or two after that, it's just so the cup will be a joke. But that's up to you. I'm not going back to do the cup just yet. First off, Gummy Garage. No, not the Kingdom. No. We're editing the High Wind. Alright. Yay! Our ship looks terrible, but it is still freaking amazing. <laughs> Alright, so you'll notice now, there's a warp hole here. We're gonna visit it. Now we're super fast, and we've got lasers, and we've got giant cannons, and where our power is much higher. It's just amazing. Yeah, you'll notice I can track on I can lock onto enemies now. Like ship automatically will do that, and if I push triangle then it'll blast these guys. It's just wonderful. Oh there we go. The lasers cost arm. Alright, right here. This is the warp hole. You actually need to move into it. Looks suspicious. Maybe it leads to another world. And ooh, the sky is much more ominous now. Oh, slow down. And this is why I equipped all the extra armor. Oh, we're fighting new ships. Did I just die? I just died! That is amazing. Wow. <laughs> That might be, like, the first time in history I have ever died in a gummy ship mission. Yeah, what the heck was that? Who knows? Ow! I can't believe I didn't destroy that ship! I shot it, like, probably 50 times. Wow, this is going terribly. <laughs> Still, I'm loving this death beam I have. It's amazing. Ow! What the heck? How do you even dodge that? Okay, I swear that is not 
in like normal mode. All right. So we're approaching the tunnel. We need to break. Yeah. There we go. Now the change in music implies that this area is a lot more dangerous. So we'll have to be careful, or we'll be roadkill. Yep, here we are! We have arrived at Agrabah! I love Aladdin. It's a great movie. One of my favorite Disney movies, if not my favorite. What's Maleficent doing here? And the keyhole? The Heartless are searching for it now. I'm certain we'll find it soon enough. So that just leaves... <laughs> Jafar, I've looked everywhere for Jasmine. She disappeared like magic. <laughs> the girl is more trouble than she's worth. You said you had things under control. Agrabah is full of holes for rats to hide in. But why worry about Princess Jasmine? With her, or without her, surely this world will be ours when we find the keyhole. We need all seven princesses of heart to open the final door. Any fewer is useless. Well, if the princess is that important, we'll find her. Find Jasmine, and bring her to me at once. Don't steep yourself in darkness too long. The heartless consume the careless. Maleficent well, seems pretty wise. <laughs> Your concern is touching, but hardly necessary. Okay, no, no offense out of all of the princesses, to be of pure heart, Jasmine is definitely not one of the ones I would expect. And Agrabah has fantastic music. Yes, so our way to lock onto the pot that there is absolutely no way for you to get. Alright, well the nice thing about Agrabah is there is a lot of treasure here. Like a Mega Potion. There's also a storage room in here with a save point, which is nice. And of course a treasure chest. With another Mega Potion. Oh, we can't get that chest yet. We need Green Trinity to reach it. Mega Ether, that's different. That actually restores MP. Oh, and the nice thing about Agrabah, you get a lot of money in this world. That'll let us buy more cannons for a gummy ship. One bad thing about this world is the camera is extremely uncooperative at times. Alright, let's go to Main Street. USA. Man, the bandits are tough.
Who dared throw their sword at me? Go, Donald. All right. Ooh. If I unequip scan, I could get lucky strike. Oh, MP haste. Yeah, forget Berserk Donald. You want MP haste instead. Oh, Goofy's got too many stuff. Whirl after an enemy using shield to attack. Costs one MP. Well, I mean, Goofy hardly has any MP to begin with, so... His sword is like, I don't trust you guys with any of this. <laughs> like, you, you guys don't get your own potions, no way. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Uh, instead of Blizzard, I'm going to equip Arrow. That deploys a barrier that absorbs damage, consumes 2 MP. So basically, that'll increase your defense and damage enemies that get too close to you. It's pretty good. How's the Smasher working for you, Goofy? And, uh, let's go in here. We're just gonna crash inside Aladdin's house, if that's okay. Aladdin, I know you're homeless, but, like, we're homeless too, so can we, like, live with you? Also, why does Aladdin have puppies in his house? Kinda weird. We're just, like, going in here and looting Aladdin of all of his valuables. To be fair, he totally deserves it. I mean, he is a street rat. I'm just kidding, I actually really like Aladdin. Jasmine, that is not the best hiding spot. We could be working for Jafar. I'm Jasmine. My father is the Sultan of Agrabah. Uh, so that makes you a princess. But he's been deposed by Jafar, who now controls the city. Jafar? You haven't heard of him? He's the royal vizier. He's gained evil powers and seized Agrabah. Nobody saw it coming. He's desperately looking for something. Something he calls the Keyhole. Jafar caught me trying to escape, but he helped me. Wait, wait. Who helped you? We were hiding nearby, but he left a while ago to take care of something. Oh, I hope Aladdin's all right. Aladdin? Where might I find this street rat? If we just had to give voice talent just for Jafar's voice right there. Jasmine, allow me to find you more suitable company, my dear princess. These little rats won't do you see. Jafar, you and me right now. Jasmine, run! <laughs> that was not a run, Jasmine. Ah, <laughs> the boy who holds the key. It was bonier than I expected. Did Tarzan get to you? All right, I'll show off Arrow. I think. So we've now got a nice little wind tornado around us. Man, that consumes a lot of MP. Or maybe I just didn't have full MP from the last fight. My stuff. Oh heck no. Yeah, see, like, these guys hardly do any damage when I have arrow on. Can I please open the chest now? Yay. Oh, another Mega Potion. Also, there are a lot of locks in Agrabah. You gotta jump quickly across those. And I believe... Ow! Oh, what a jerk. <laughs> Great A platforming as always, Sora. Much tougher enemies in this world, yet they're only giving me 2 EXP per hit. 
I think my time of early level ups is finally ended. Ooh, pot spiders! They can sneak up on you, but they give you a lot of money when you defeat them, so that's cool. Oh, never mind, they don't give you that much money. Mega Ether? Heal. You want to be careful when casting heal while you're falling, because if you hit the ground before you've finished healing yourself, you won't it'll cancel the heal. So that's Aladdin's house. That leads to the alley we just went there. I appear to have lost my way. <laughs> Agarai is kind of maze-like. Must be something in the main street we're missing. So that leads to the alleyway. Must be something high up we can do. So that way's closed. We just can uh, move the camera. The terrible camera strikes again. Don't know why I'm even surprised. You guys again? Probably summoned Simba more. He was really good at killing the Heartless in Traverse Town. I'll leave them to deal with the Heartless. I'm going back to the exit. Because I want to say there must be something up here that I was missing. Oh well, I think we're out of time for this episode, so let's go back to the storage room and save and quit. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Colorful Artie, and I hope to see you for the next episode of Kingdom Hearts. We're going to explore Agrabah more, and who knows, maybe we'll fight Jafar. Anyways, have a great day, and God bless.